Good evening. My name is Kara Walker. I've been a sea level researcher so far, but I've been chosen by you to become one of Director Golden's Decadal Planning Team Manager. I would like to personally thank you for the chance you're granting me. Together with Martin Evans here, who's been my supervisor since I joined NASA, I analyze with great care the tasks my team will be required to perform and my job within it. I must admit that I was very impressed by the responsibilities you have entrusted me with, despite my young age. But I believe I can't accept this job. I'd rather keep my former role within my new team as well. This is not because I have anything against the director's project, but I'd like to pursue a different approach to the agency's projects. The guidelines of Director Golden are very easy. Faster, better, cheaper. We know what they actually mean. They're a brutal cut to the agency's budget, which is already very restricted. As I was told many times, I'm not in a position to assess and judge these procedures. But, together with Martin, we've realized a system to create a chain of companies working alongside NASA's projects. It's the True Space Explorer Foundation, which will have authority over all private companies you will decide to offer a contract to. By doing this, costs of research and most of the decadal planning team's projects will be relieved from the agency's budget, and the director will be able to sleep easier at night. Obviously. The management of the Foundation will be assumed by a governing board of which I am going to be part of, as founder and financer. Martin Evans, more experienced than I am, is going to take care of the administration. He shares with me the same point of view, which is seeing the man becoming once again an explorer and conquering the last frontier of human exploration, space. The direction taken by the government bureaucrats is clearly wrong. Without someone leading us towards the right way, 50 years of research and the sacrifice of valiant men, not least my father, would be useless. And what for? Saving money with the purpose of expanding markets completely useless to our survival as a species. No, I'm not going to allow this, if I can even slightly affect the history of the human exploration of space, then I'll devote myself to it! It's for people like my father that I'm giving birth today to the TSEF, and for those who have always looked at the stars for our future! I hope I didn't take up too much of your time. As you can see, the economical advantages are many. I guess the news will make Director Golden very glad. Thank you, everybody.